Hello everyone, just want to do a little update on my 40 gallon guppy tank. If you watched my other video, you have seen that I had a beta in my female sorority tank. That didn't work out that well. Looks like my females and him started getting into it. So I took him out and put him inside a 10 gallon guppy tank. And they started doing so well that I ended up buying this 40 breeder. And as you can see, it's been set up for about three weeks now. I started with about maybe eight females and three male guppies. And as you can see, there's well over probably 50 guppies in here right now. Um, I used some play sand. There's some guppy grass or just some regular moss. Got some Anubias. Um, I still have the water lettuce up there and got some cool snails that are all over the place. They just started breeding recently. Um, the male beta is somewhere over there hiding because he loves to rest on top of the filter. But so far so good. I haven't had any issues. Um, my quarry cat loves it in here. I ended up losing three quarry cats in my other tank, in my dirted tank, and I put him in here, and so far he's doing great, no problems. He has some buddies in my hospital tank that I'm gonna be bringing out after I'm done with quarantine. Let me see if I can see the, oh sorry for the glare. Let's see if we can see the male beta. And he's not coming out. Usually when I stick my hand in here, he comes out. Well, this time it's not working. All I got is attacked by guppies. So yeah, they're, they're doing great. They love it in there. If you look in there, there's all sorts of babies. Last time I counted them, there was probably about another 25 babies in there. Which I think the beta picks them off too, because, oh, well, there he is. The guest made his cameo. He gets along with the guppies. He doesn't really fight with the males. Chases the females around a little bit, but so far he's doing great in there. He's, I think he's way better in here than he was with the female betas. And he looks a lot healthier and a lot happier. He's not as stressed. And he loves hiding right there in the water lettuce. And I actually turned down the current because he wasn't doing well with uh, AquaClear. I kind of made that kind of slow down a little bit just because he was kind of like being pushed all over the place. And I think the guppies love the still water as well. I just did a water change. There's a whole bunch of babies in there like I said. There's actually, they're not out right now, but there's a whole bunch of cherry shrimp as well. Anyways, there he is. I had a couple people ask me what ended up happening. Oh, he's right there next to the snail. A couple people asking me what happened with my male beta in the female sorority house, and here it is. It didn't work out as planned. He has an awesome temperament. He's not very aggressive, but my females just did not like him. They were team up on him and just, you know, nip at his um, fins and. I didn't want him to get hurt. As you can see, he's a good looking beta. And he just, he loves swimming with the other fish. He often goes and hides inside right there, that pot. Um, I had to kind of cover up that piece of wood because I caught him and they're kind of stuck. So if you guys ever get that chala wood or whatever it's called, be careful because it looks like betas love to go in there exploring and they will get stuck. Also, so do um, guppies. Um, the baby guppies are fine, but the bigger ones, not so much. But anyways, there he is, showing off now. Anyways, thank you for watching. Let me know if you have any questions.